I'm working on a project about um, the, the, the fantasy of total representation and about representations of absence in digital context is focused on the idea of um, the intersection of aesthetics and public discourse. My paper is entitled Enlightenment the Remix. It's, it's about the way that transparency as uh, an aesthetic and as a method uh, is used by artists in some contexts and here in a digital context and how that is related to um, scientific objectivity, scientific method, and journalistic objectivity, all as um, uh, abdications of responsibility for one's own work. And in this particular case, the way that that in turn takes the people who are the sampled rather than the sampler and falsely attributes agency to them uh, creates a, a kind of false narrative of participation when these people um, in fact never agreed to participate in anything at all and so um, ultimately creates a situation in which um, people, it's unclear whether people are subjects or objects. It's unclear whether we should talk about them as having any power over this artwork or participation in this artwork or not. The presentation generally is focused on a cycle of seven music videos by an Israeli artist uh, who goes by the pseudonym Kutiman, um, Ophir Kutil. The cycle of music videos is called Through You. Um, beyond that, I just tell people to, to go to YouTube and search for it and have a look for themselves. I'm just really interested to hear um, the... I, I, want, I want people to disagree with me about this because it, it, the, the story that I tell is in some ways a bit sad. It undermines the idea that Remix is a, a bottom-up cultural force. It undermines the idea that it's a democratizing or populist or resistant practice. Um, I, I think that in, in the history of remix practices that it has often been true that it was used to those ends, um, but I'm not, I'm not convinced that it always is, um, that it always was, and I, I definitely don't think it was in this particular case that I'm analyzing. So um, yeah, I mean, I, I just look forward to um, talking with um, techno-utopians and technophobes alike.